In Marion County, two teens fresh off an arrest are now back behind bars. These mugshots are from the first arrest when police say they were wearing body armor and shooting at each other. One of their friends actually died. Now the two are charged with something new. These new mug shots are from the latest arrest involving a drive-by. And Fox 35 anchor Ray Vieta is live in the Alert Center tonight with this latest arrest. Ray. Hi, Luann. Joshua Vining and Colton Whitler are the two teenagers arrested again. Newly released body camera and 911 audio puts us all right there as the whole thing unfolded. 310. I just heard there's sounds like rifles being shot to set the scene. It's 1120 PM Wednesday on North Pine Avenue in Ocala. Officers are in the middle of a traffic stop when they hear gunshots. The officers jump into their squad car and head towards the sounds. They spot a Mercedes speeding through a stop sign and pull it over inside four teenage boys. What's going on guys? Why are you guys all sweaty? The officer also asked why the driver was speeding and if they heard gunshots. The officer then spots a firearm inside the car. Three times, I got a rifle in the driver's seat. Step out of the vehicle. Step out of the vehicle. I'm not gonna hit you one more time. Yes, step, sir, out, yes, step out of the car. Hands behind your back. The officers recovered a rifle and three pistols. One of the guns was hidden inside a pizza box. Two of the suspects were charged with aggravated manslaughter earlier this month. Investigators say Joshua Vining, Colton Whitler, and a 13 took turns shooting at each other while wearing body armor. That 13 suffered a gunshot wound and died at the hospital. Whitler and Vining now facing several new charges. The two other suspects in the car, 19-year-old Jarrett Vining and a 16-year-old boy. The older Vining bonded out of jail an hour after booking. We're working to learn if the other suspects were also released. Live in the Alert Center, I'm Ray Vieta. Luen and John, back to you.